All right, so you're supposed to be in groups of three or four. And I'm going to show you two ways how to do this. Let me know. Well, I was waiting for... Well, hold up. Hold up. I was waiting for you guys to be quiet. Okay. We're going to write the... We're gonna, this is a slope formula worksheet. Slope formula is y2 minus y1 divided by x2 minus x1. That's the first step. Write it down. Second step, label them. x1, y1, x2, y2. Next step we're going to do is we're going to plug these in. We have 8 minus negative 4 over negative 3 minus 1. That ends up being equal to, well, if you have minus a negative number, it's the same as adding 12 over negative 4. 12 divided by negative 4 is going to be negative 3. Move over. Do you guys want to know the shortcut way to do this? Okay, shortcut way. Well, we're going to have I'm just rewriting this up here. 5, negative 2, negative 1, 2, right? And we know we wanted to subtract them. So another way you can subtract things is just by changing the signs. So we're going to change this side. What's the opposite of 1, negative 1? And what's the opposite of 2? Negative 2. Add these together. Negative 4 and 6. The, this was the x values, this was the y values. Look at their formula, what goes on top? X's or y's? Y's. So negative 4 was our y over 6, which is the same as negative 3, oops, sorry, negative 2 thirds. Okay? Alright, try doing the rest on your, in groups. This is for, it's for a grade.